in so many ways I wanna sing about it each and every day Look, look, look and see, see, see how Jesus loves me Jesus loves me I'll shout, shout, shout and sing, sing, sing Cause Jesus loves me Jesus loves me so I'm Funny Man Dan. And I'm Max. And there's no place I would rather be than right here with you and my friend Max. I love getting to speak to all my friends and you, Funny Man Dan. We're here to have fun, explore the Bible and learn all about today's big point. What is today's big point, Max? FMD likes to sleep in. That's right, FMD likes to sleep in. What? <laughs> Got you again. Oh, Max, you know me too well. We still don't know today's big point. Hmm. Maybe our host Audrey will know. Oh, Audrey! Hi, funny man Dan. Do you know today's big point? I do. Jesus has the power over death. Thanks, Audrey. We'll see you soon. And I'll see you later. Explorers, grab your backpacks. Test out your binoculars. And fasten your seatbelts. Because today, Funny Man Dan, Max and you are going on an adventure of discovery. What about today's big badge? Oh, I almost forgot. After today's quest, we'll be earning a big badge. What's today's big badge, Max? The Resurrection Badge. Ah, the Resurrection Badge. That's right, Jesus rose again. Unlike you, who sleeps in. <laughs> Oh, Max, let's start today's adventure with the big story. What a good place to start. One day, Jesus was traveling through a town called Nain. He was with his disciples and a large crowd was following them. When they had arrived at the gates of the town, they noticed that a man was being carried out. They discovered the man had died and was being carried out beside his mother. Jesus' heart went out to the widow. Don't cry, he said, filled with compassion for her. This widow had not only lost her husband, but has now lost her only son. Since she no longer had a husband, her son was her hope for the future. Without him, she had nothing left. Life for a widow in the time of Jesus was very tough and even tougher for those who had not had children. This woman knew that every day from that day forward was going to be a battle. Jesus went to the men who were carrying the coffin. They stood very still as Jesus leaned toward the man and spoke to him saying, Young man, I say to you, arise. 
How could a dead man rise up again? This was impossible. But as Jesus spoke those words, the man slowly sat up and then began to speak. He had come to life again. From what seemed like the end, Jesus called him back to life for a new beginning. The entire crowd were in awe and erupted in praise, giving glory to God as the mother embraced her son. Jesus is more powerful than anything, even death itself. Jesus has power over death. Dad wants to show me something they can do with a potato. We need to start by putting in these nails into the potato. We can't eat it now. We have these clips and I have to connect them to the nails. There can't be any gaps. No way. The light has come on, but they only are plugged in to the potato. Dad says even though it might not look like it, there is enough power in the potato to power the light. This is like Jesus. He might not have looked like it on the outside, but on the inside, he had unlimited power, even over death. How incredible has it been learning that Jesus raised people from the dead? What does this mean for us? The day he was raised up to life, he took control over death. We can follow him and trust that nothing can separate us from his love and power. Is Jesus your friend? Would you like to live with him forever in heaven? Yeah. Yes? Well then, I officially present to you with today's big badge. The resurrection badge. Congratulations, you did it! Another badge earned, another lesson learned. Bye, everybody! Hello! <laughs> Jesus has power over death. Huh? Jesus has power over death. Jesus has power over death. Death. Na, 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 na. Save me.